guys this is ash gates from victor visuals on this video i'll be showing you guys uh, especially a diploma guys how to program your linux on windows so most of the people won't be having a linux system in the home so as per as your diploma syllabus um, i think it's on fourth sem you have linux lab and they have given you to do Pro, uh, script programming on Linux and most probably you won't be having Linux at home if you want to uh, program at home most of the diploma guys so I'll be showing you how to program your Linux on Windows so the first thing you have to do is you need an active internet connection and follow this video all you have to do is go to start and open control panel you won't be seeing control panel as soon as you open the start if you can if you don't see control panel just click here where they say type to search and type control panel okay. go to control panel and click on programs and click on turn windows features on or off scroll down to find linux subsystem for windows it's windows subsystem for linux just click on it and click ok and please wait till the files get installed and you probably need to restart your pc so let's restart our pc now so we are back to pc after having a small restart now you have to do is go to the microsoft store and search for a linux distribution from store so we can try a ubuntu or open source i'll be going with ubuntu which is the famous linux distribution available on store as well as uh, it's the best uh, distribution for beginners so let's try now let's type b let's search for ubuntu And we have the latest version of uh, 18.04 LTS. I'll be that's LTS means long term service. So let's select Ubuntu 18.04 and click on install. So it's uh, about uh, 214 MB, and this is the first stage of install. After this, uh, you, you have further installation. So you will have to wait. So the files are getting downloaded. Now what you do is do not launch from the store itself, now close the store. Now go to start menu and click on type here to search where you trigger the quota and type hmm, cmd command prompt and run mission it as an administrator to click on yes now what you do is type ubuntu b u e n t u ubuntu Ubuntu 1804. We download the version 1 18.04. You just click Ubuntu 1804 and click hit enter. So, as you see currently, the pending installation is being done now. So, it may take few minutes and it depends upon the configuration of your system. If you have SSD, the work will get done faster. If you have an hard disk, it might take time depending upon the speed of your hard disk oh, I'll be fast forwarding here guys so as you see the installation has been finished now let's enter a, a username for it no, just enter something or just enter your name as a username 
for the Linux subsystem. So I'll be entering my name here. Ash. Just click on enter. And you will have to enter password. I'll be giving a simple password and you will have to note that when you type password you won't be seeing any dot or star there but continue typing your password and retype your password for the confirmation password has been updated successfully and this is how you install Linux subsystem for Windows uh, especially uh, Diploma guys have to make note of this because you have Linux on your fourth sum. Thus, if you have to program Linux in your home, most of the people won't be having a Linux based system in home, most people will be having Windows. And it for beginners installing Linux on their Windows system might delete all their files. And this is how you install Linux subsystem for Windows. And I'll be back with more window. I'll be back with uh, another video where I will show you how to program on Linux. And this and this video is about how to install Linux subsystem for Windows. I hope you enjoyed this video. I mean, this video was edu uh, informative to you. See you on the next video. Signing out, Ash Gates.